we're living in a complex world. And why is this? Because there are so many people and things that interact with each other, we influence each other, and that changes the system in sometimes unpredictable ways. There could be entirely new properties and functionalities. Individuals form groups, groups form organizations, and new things happen. And all of that is necessary to understand in order to shape our future successfully. Complexity science is trying to understand exactly this. In a network world, the intended effects of what you do would not always happen. In many cases, you would see side effects, you would see feedback effects, you would see cascading effects. If you want to successfully shape the world to the better, you need to understand these things because otherwise you would improve one thing and two other things would deteriorate. So it's very important really to understand how one thing leads to other things that cause again other things. So all these feedback loops and interdependencies make up a complex system and that requires complexity science in order to really understand the full picture. Now, once you have that knowledge and you understand how the world works, and linear thinking, which we usually learn at school, is not informing us well. So once we have that better understanding of all those unexpected effects of interactions and feedbacks and cascading effects, we can build a better world and this is how society can benefit from that science.